So we're gonna do another one of these videos, Jacked in a Box. Muscle and Fitness Magazine sends me a box of supplements and I tell you what I think about it. But, interesting thing happened this weekend, someone shared a video on my wall from another fitness channel, Ice Cream Fitness is what he calls himself, and Ice Cream Fitness Man has been giving his honest opinion of certain supplements to his viewers and the fucking corporations don't like that shit. Because he's saying that, you know, perhaps I don't like this supplement. It's not good. I've gotten bad results with it. But the corporate masters don't like it when you talk bad about them, right? Because apparently that's devaluing their credibility in the marketplace. And we're not as free as we think we are. You can't just say shit, right? Fucking Gestapo will come and get you. So they're suing his ass, right? I'm taking him for all his money. Everything he's got, right? Poor YouTube channel, dude. Ice cream fitness. They're taking him to court because he gave his, his, his honest opinion about this shit. So I don't want to get on the bad side of my corporate masters, right? Yes, sir. I do as you say, sir. Please, please don't shut down my YouTube channel, sir. So I'ma only say nice shit about what's in this box today. And I'ma say everything with a big smile just like this. So you can't say Elliot Hulse is making you look bad in the marketplace cause I'ma only say nice things, I'ma smile the whole fucking time. Come after me, please. I'ma kill you with kindness. So, you understand? All right, knife. Again, I don't know what's in here, so, you know, purely spontaneous, like all my videos are. I say what the hell comes up. But this time, I'm calculating. I've gotta calculate my kindness here. Very first thing we find is a workout card that gives us a superset on the shoulders. Shoulder superset, can't go wrong. Elliot Hulse talks about supersets in some of his videos. And if you do the superset and do it this way, you see that guy, you look just like him. You will be shredded, you'll be ripped, you look like you're completely dehydrated simply by doing overhead presses in this superset fashion. Thank you, Jack in the Box, for sharing your wisdom with us. Now, magic Jack in the Box. Muscle Martini. It can't be fucking bad because it's a goddamn martini and everybody loves getting drunk before they work out, right? What better way to sell something than to link it to alcohol, right? Because we're all fucking degenerates. I like working out and getting hammered too. Well, let's drink some muscle fucking martini. This is good, this is right, it's mixed berry candy. Mixed berry fucking candy. Because bodybuilders love candy, don't we? Synthet 6 Isolate. It's gotta be good because it's such a complicated fucking name. And anything in a box this shiny has got to be magical. I can see it now. If I drink this shit, I guarantee muscles are just gonna grow instantly. Let's see what it says on the box. Protein serving, fast and slow digesting, isolate matrix. I mean, everything in the matrix is true. Naturally occurring ears per serving because I want some naturally occurring fucking ears in my protein shake. Now, if you want naturally occurring ears in your protein shake, this is what you're going to want to drink and eat, right? Because it's so natural to eat ears. Glycofuse. Don't confuse with ton fucking fuse. Because the bigger the words, the more powerful the shit. Rapid Recovery Performance Supercarb. It's not just carbs, folks. It's supercarb. And anything with the word super in front of it's got to be good. Clinically studied in real athletes. Well, that's great because the last supplement I took was clinically studied in fake athletes. And we all know only real athletes take this shit. Dopamine. Do Dopamite. Activates fat burning control center. I didn't even know fat burning had a control center. Shit, if I only knew, I would have activated it earlier, but I don't need to because MHP created dopamine. 
dopaminogenic fat burning catalyst. Like I said, big words equals better supplement. And that bitch on the cover is hot as hell. That guy probably gonna get some. He gonna dip into that pudding, see? Dopamite, hot bitches and pudding. Protein rush, because we ain't want to use that slow protein. We want protein that moves fast. Rush, not even move fast. Oh, now I'm getting in trouble because this had fast digesting protein, but this one got rushing protein. This shit is just fast. This motherfucker's rushing. That means that there's a neurotic component to how fast it moves. It ain't just moving fast, it's crazy fast because he's rushing. And we all know how good it is to rush, right? Haste makes more muscle. I'm happy my protein is gonna rush, rush right into my muscle. Chocolate dream. Because all bodybuilders think about is chocolate dreams, right? Last time you had a chocolate dream. In fact, I might have a chocolate dream tonight while I'm rushing to get my protein to digest. Boy, what else? Amino lights. Because electrolytes are for pussies. We need amino lights. Because amino means protein. So not only is it gonna hydrate, but it's going to build. Train harder, recover faster. Advanced amino matrix. One of these matrix supplements again. Boy, I'm so happy we in the matrix. And the matrix is giving us all great shit like this called beast in a blue bottle. Let's see what else it says on the back. All beast products are rigorously tested for assy showing purity. I swear to God it says that. Look, assy, right there. A-S-S-A-Y, -S -S assy. Is that kind of like ass chested? Assy showing purity. Man, I'm so happy because I was worried that it was going to have Dicky showing purity or booby showing purity. Because it's assy showing purity, it's tied to the digestive system. It's got to be good. Microbials to detect bacteria and mold. Well, that's great. I didn't know that was something I had to worry about. Because these supplements are so damn good that why would they have to test for bacteria and mold? I mean, there ain't no bacteria and mold in my steak, right? but I guess they ain't clinically testing them shits. So I better start eating this instead of steaks because they're testing it for bacteria mold. Heavy metals including mercury and lead. Well, good thing they test them for that shit. As if I don't have enough fucking mercury in my mouth, we might have been getting it in the supplements, but not Beast, because Beast tests all its supplements. Ugh, assault. Anything that sounds that aggressive must get you to secrete more anabolic hormones because to assault means to fuck shit up. And if I take this energy, strength, endurance, raspberry lemonade drink, I'm gonna assault the fucking workout by muscle farm. Nope, not farm like the animal farm, PHA arm. Basically, they're saying that this shit is like pharmaceutical. Pharmaceutical grade assault. Your doctor can't even give you this. That's how high tech this shit is. You go to your doctor and say, yo doc, you know, I'm not feeling so good before my workouts. I need something that's gonna give me a little bit more oomph. He's gonna say, sorry, you can't get assault here. You can only get it in Jack in the Box. And finally, Quest Bar. Because after you eat it, you're gonna be on a quest to find the nearest toilet bowl. Huh? Which is good because there's a lot of fiber in this. I ain't saying something bad about you. Quest bar, protein bar, white chocolate, raspberry, get tough, be strong, but also lick fruit off your fingertips. Protein company. I'm not saying nothing bad about you. I don't wanna fuck with you corporate masters. I just wanna be a good little slave and tell everybody what you want me to tell them. So keep sending me your shit. Uh, keep sending me your stuff. And I make sure they buy it. Go buy this stuff, folks. Go buy it. Fuck! See that shit? I almost cut my fucking finger off, bro.
Look at that. That's why I shouldn't play with, with knives. Fuck, look at that. Do you see that? It cuts right through. Good thing I didn't cut my whole fucking finger off. Straight to the bone. Yeah, yeah, I didn't want to open it up. <clears throat> what an asshole. You see what happens when I get ungrounded? I'm acting all stupid in this video. Next thing you know, I cut my fucking hand open. I didn't realize the knife was there when I swiped. God damn it.